Hey guys and welcome to episode 10 of Pax to the Max and just like the previous episode we start off this episode by going straight into a match but first we do apply some contracts to both Abati and Dallas Sandro and then we search for our first opponent. Now you could see in the previous episode that we did a little bit better. We, we recovered from our lost streak and we are now on 7 points. I believe going into this first match and we come against this, uh, this guy with a really poor team. I mean if you're playing Division 1 and you got uh, such bad chemistry that is not good in my opinion anyway we do manage to take the lead in the third minute already through D'Alessandro nice chip and then it's Abate here stealing the ball giving it to Lamella Lamella with an over top through ball to D'Alessandro who uh, does a near post OP finish and he makes it 2-0 in the 25th minute so we were on a little bit of a roll very comfortable lead, but then my opponent struck back. It was Ruben Castro sending Huntelaar away. Good finesse around my keeper. Again, pretty poor saves. The ball went kind of right through the middle, but you know, uh, I'll give him the goal, and that makes it 2-1. Then we put in a corner kick. It's Angelo Ogbonna getting his head on the ball, and he makes it 3-1 just after half time. And then... Um, just before the end of the match, Thiago Neves going through on goal, seeing Wellington on the other side of the box. Now Raul roughly uh, on the other side of the box, and he uh, puts it into the back of the net, making that 4-1. So, uh, yeah, another three points to add to our tally, and that means we're now on 10 uh, points out of uh, six matches, I believe. I'm not too sure about the uh, amount of matches we played. Uh, yes, it was indeed six matches, as you can see right there. We only have four games remaining, and we need four more points to make sure that we do indeed uh, promote to Division 1. And we need seven points... Um we need seven more points to actually win the title of Division 2, as you uh, could have seen right there. And in the second match of the episode, we come up against a 4 one 2 one 2 a Premier League side. Pretty st st strong looking squad, but not the most original, like uh, pretty uh, overused players. It was Wellington putting us into the lead in the 11th minute, so a pretty early goal once again. But my opponent managed to equalize the uh, equalizer here as Juan Mata gives the ball to Walker, and that is a really good finish for a right back with his weak foot powers it into the back of the net. And he makes it 1-1 one, one, uh, just after my goal. And then just after his goal, like seconds after, it was Abate uh, putting in a cross. And Wellington putting his head on the ball. He made it 2-1. And that was actually also the final score of the game. So it was three very uh, early goals in that match. But, uh, you know, that was the only thing that really happened. And we managed to take another three points. So, uh, yeah, that means we're now on 13 points. Three games remaining. So uh, we're really close to promotion, which is, of course, a good thing to see. And uh, we'll go search for a third and final match of this episode now. And uh, of course, we do want to take another three points because that would secure our promotion to Division 1. And we come up against a... Um 4-3-1 to Bundesliga side. Pretty good looking side. Pretty solid as well. And um, we do manage to take the lead here as D'Alessandro sends Wellington away. Really nice volley by Wellington. And uh, he makes it 1-0 in the 13 minutes. So another early goal from us. And that's a really good start again. And we even managed to double our lead here as um, uh, Michel Bastos here sends away Wellington. Uh, he managed to beat his keeper to the ball. And uh, he heads the ball into the empty net making that 2-0. Then it was Lamella here doing some skills, giving the ball to Abate. Abate uh, just takes it uh, around his defender, puts it into the box. D'Alessandro got the uh, rebound after a Wellington header. Good save by his keeper, uh, to be fair. But uh, we made it 3-0 nonetheless. Then it was my opponent who got a goal back, as it was the youth sending Royce away. Royce gave the ball to uh, Macchiali, that is, and uh, he makes it a 3-1. Pretty good finish uh, in this 69th minute. Making that 3-1 as I just mentioned. And then it was um, my opponent getting another constellation goal right here. As he sends a Marco Royce a throw on goal. And he sweats it across to the youth. And uh, he makes a 3-2. So, uh, yeah, things were getting a little bit tense now. But uh, fortunately for us, it was D'Alessandro here. Getting past a player with a running Waka Waka. Pretty nice looking skill, or actually it was not running Waka Waka, but from a borrow. Anyway, he managed to put it into the back of the net, make that 4-2, which was indeed the final score of the game. So that means we got three wins this episode, which does indeed secure uh, the promotion to Division 1. And that means that uh, we need to play a uh, one more match, and if we manage to uh, win that match, we do indeed get the title uh, of Division 2, which is pretty impressive in my opinion, because we would be on a pretty nice win streak in that case. Anyway, this has been it for today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like rating. It would be awesome if we could have 30 likes again. Uh, also, if you're new around here, make sure to subscribe to my channel and check out some of my other series as well. And without further ado, I'll catch you guys in my next video. So, peace.